I would like to request all of you to kindly join me in welcoming Simran Chane Gaglani, AVP Brand Solutions, Viacom 18 Sports, with a huge round of applause on the stage. Hi, thank you, everybody. Um, I'm just waiting for my Perfect. clicker, but while we wait, Thanks. such interesting conversation about diversity in India, such a diverse country, but if there are any two things that bring India together, it's IPL and Big Boss, and thankfully, I represent Geo Cinema, and Geo Cinema has both. Uh, so today, we'll talk about a little bit about IPL, though. Can I get the clicker? So of course, a lot of conversation about diversity, equity, inclusiveness. Uh, however, I will first talk a little bit about another D, which is digital, and the digital revolution that's happening in the country today. Um, and specifically, what's happening on connected TV. Uh, the reason why we thought it's important to talk about it is because really what we've seen on IPL this time has been a huge game changer for us. Uh, and I think, you know, as marketers, entrepreneurs, we're constantly thinking about ways to reach out uh, to a premium audience, to a diverse audience. Uh, important to know what you can do on a platform like GeoCinema on Connected TV. So first highlight, of course, like I said, uh, you know, we had a huge revolution on digital on GeoCinema this year. 449 million users, unique users had been reached on IPL. We exited IPL with a 95 million daily active user base. I mean, that's actually larger than some, you know, a few of the countries of Europe put together, right? So at a daily active user level, uh, you know, that's the number we exited at. And at a monthly level, we, were at, we are at 275 million monthly active users. But more interestingly, while of course, you know, I think IPL viewership, since we made IPL free for anybody to watch, this year, whether they are on mobile or connected TV or on the web, uh, we always knew that we are going to do game-changing numbers. Uh, but I think the one thing that kind of, you know, very, very pleasantly surprised us as well and kind of, you know, exceeded our estimates as well was the number that we were able to achieve on the connected TV universe. So on Geo Cinema for IPL 2023, we had 126 million users, unique users watching. Uh, which actually is ahead of all industry estimates. Actually, Google was actually estimating this number to get, uh, you know, this audience to get to this number in 2025. But our platform has, you know, shown that it's, you know, it's possible to achieve this number. Um, given a few levers, if you can apply those as well, right? And I think the whole connection with diversity, equity, etc., will come when we talk about, uh, you know, some of those levers. Uh, but the biggest one, of course, for us um, on achieving this number has been some of the strategic partnerships that we did strike uh, with you know, OEM operators uh, and also with partners like a Google TV, Geo, Xiaomi, etc. Right? So Geo Cinema was available on all of these uh, connected TV platforms, leading to uh, you know, that spike in the number. Right? And interestingly, actually, um, if you put this as a like-to-like -like comparison, connected TV versus high-definition TV, uh, the connected TV audience today in the country, especially on IPL, was 4x the high def audience. Uh, and that's the number that we have seen. Uh, of course, the number here has been uh, you know, calculated by uh, minusing the OH number that HD has also reported. The reason why we thought you know, we should do that is because, I mean, all of us have seen IPL in a bar or in an outside environment, right? And we know that consumption of the tournament in either a bar, restaurant, airport, railway station scenario is probably a little more passive compared to the way you would consume it at home. And we thought, you know, probably it's not really the right comparison. Because when you're watching at home with your family or friends, you're far more involved and far more engaged with the tournament as well, right? So uh, the right apples to apples comparison actually is to see at a household level. And at household level, actually, Geo Cinema uh, reached, uh, you know, CTV on Geo Cinema and IPL reached about 30 million households, whereas high def television reached about seven and a half million households. So that's sort of, you know, the the index between uh, both the reach. And, um, you know, like I mentioned at the beginning, the reason why we were able to do this, and so much of the conversation today has been about diversity, and I think some of the folks that were present here also touched upon, uh, you know, why are we discussing diversity only as a factor of gender? Um, and at Geosinma, we completely agree. 
uh, diversity in a country like India is also such a factor of language. It's a factor of interest. It's a, it's a factor of devices. Uh, and I think the reason why we were able to do what we did uh, on IPL this year uh, was because we A, serviced multiple languages. For the first time ever, IPL was available to view in 12 different languages uh, to users. Um, in fact, much to our delight, and I'm sure a lot of you would have probably even noticed, the Punjabi and Bhojpuri language feeds actually kind of went viral because a lot of people were watching, uh, you know, obviously it was the first time they were watching the game in these two languages. Um, so many of the people were retweeting Ravi Kishan's quotes, who was on the commentary panel. So many of the people were retweeting, uh, you know, how the Punjabi commentators were talking about it. So bringing together the entire piece of language diversity and servicing probably those underserved markets by having language feeds. For the first time ever, uh, you know, we were also we also had four interest feeds. So. If you were a fantasy fan, or if you were, you know, if you were really a casual consumer of IPL and didn't really want to watch every single match, we had a feed featuring, uh, you know, Sanya Mirza, which was more geared towards uh, a casual IPL consumer. Uh, we had an insider feed which featured, you know, some of the biggest stars of cricket, names like Brett Lee, names like Anil Kumble. That feed was geared more towards the core cricket consumers, so servicing the absolutely passionate cricket consumers. And of course, the Fanatics feed, which was for the first time ever. Imagine if a Mumbai Bangalore game is on uh, and you are a Bangalore fan, you can choose to actually watch commentary by fellow Bangalore fans. And obviously the banter, you know, that goes on in that sort of a scenario is very, very different from the slightly more uptight and professional commentary that you would otherwise or we have all become, you know, used to seeing for the last 30, 35 years. Uh, so these were innovations that we did. And of course, for our connected TV viewers, for the first time ever, IPL was available to watch on 4K, so high definition. Uh, you could be, uh, you know, you could be present in any of the metros and watch it in high def. Um, we had a few other features like hype mode and multicam also available for, uh, you know, connected TV viewers. So again, for the first time ever, if you really want to hear what's going on behind the stumps when Dhoni is, uh, you know, wicket keeping, you could actually watch the stump my camera and, you know, really. If you were lucky enough and you were watching the match at the right moment, you could probably hear what Dhoni is saying, uh, you know, to his bowler across the other side um, of the wicket, right? So some of these innovations, uh, the good thing is digital allows you to do. Uh, it allows you to service diverse audiences in a very, very meaningful way and, uh, you know, get, to get your message to them in an environment where they are very, very engaged with what they are watching. Um, and because of this, you know, whatever your audience's our belief is that you can find them on connected TV. Uh, today, uh, we are at about 90% share of the smart TV market in the country. Uh, and our internal estimates are projecting that where we are at 126 million users today, next year IPL, we will be at about 200 million users on connected TV only, right? Imagine, I mean, there is a huge shift actually that's happening in the country, uh, you know, uh, in terms of consumer behavior where people in not just the top six metros, but probably the top 100 million plus towns are shifting towards consuming a large tentpole, uh, you know, tournament like an IPL on the connected TV uh, universe. And of course, the huge plus point of being present on something like this is 100% measurability that you have with doing a digital campaign as against, you know, any other medium, um, right? So uh, on a parting note, this was a very, very quick one. We just wanted to kind of come and quickly touch base with everybody here. Uh, for marketers and entrepreneurs, uh, you know, while of course you need to think about how are you going to service your diverse audiences and how are you going to bring in the principles of inclusion and equity into your campaigns, um, really nothing can take away from scale. And uh, the beauty of a platform like IPL meeting GeoCinema is that you can service all of your diverse requirements, uh, you know, through multiple sort of touch points that we can provide for you and your brand. So, uh, you know, me and my colleagues are here. We look forward to, you know, maybe catching up with some of you and sharing some more details if you would want. Uh, but yeah, I just wanted to leave, leave you on this note. So thank you.
Ma'am, uh, I'll request you to stay back on the stage for just one more minute as I invite on stage uh, Mr. Gunjan Nagpal, Vice President and Head of Sales Fashion Entrepreneur Fund to help us felicitate you for that fabulous uh, and insightful session.